high is the ratio of circumference and the diameter of a circle, it begins with 3.1415 and it goes forever. So we use pi for everything in our daily life, uh, designing buildings, um, build bridges, highways. Pi is one of the most important constants in mathematics and our science. My name is Emma. I'm a developer advocate for Google Cloud Platform. We have calculated 31 trillion digital pi on Google Cloud Platform. In the past, um, supercomputers and desktop computers were used to calculate pi. And today, this is the first time that cloud was calculated to break the world record. So the biggest challenge is you need a lot of storage. In order to calculate 31 trillion digital pi, you need approximately 170 terabytes of storage. That's equivalent to uh, 2,000 Blu-ray discs. And also, during the calculation, we read and write a lot of data. We read 10 petabytes of data over four, over four months. So in order to download 10 petabytes of data, you would need to spend two and a half years with your home internet. And if there is a single error, like somewhere in, in those bits, uh, the final calculation will be broken. So it, it will, it's very uh, important to keep, the, uh, keep everything uh, consistent. Google Cloud has a mechanism called live migration. When there is early signs of hardware failure or when you need to upgrade the underlying operating system, Google Cloud moves the virtual machine from one host to a new host so that um, your ap application won't get interrupted by hardware failures or underlying software maintenance. When I was a kid, I, I had no idea that I would one, one day like, break the world record. <laughs> no, no, it, it's been more than 20 years since I first met Pi and thought of uh, calculating Pi. And I was able to download the program to calculate Pi on my computer. I studied computer science in university and I joined a lab where one of the professors were pre like former world record holders. He said, from an engineering standpoint, it's not really useful to have trillions of digital Pi because you probably need up to 20, 30 digits to send workers to space and you won't need more than that. Um, but, but from computer, computer uh, or software standpoint, it's really interesting to do more digits. Um, so he's, he's very, I, I don't know how to put it, but mentally, mentally consistent person. Like he, he lacks strong reactions. <laughs> um, I think they would be excited 